How's it going guys? Welcome back to another episode of Climbing Vlog. If you've been watching the last few videos, you'll know that I've started surfing recently uh, based on the amount of sunburns that I've been getting. Unfortunately, I cut my foot while surfing last week and so I haven't really been able to climb at all because the cut went from my big toe down my foot a little bit and so I haven't been able to put on a climbing shoe for a little over a week now. If you're sensitive to blood or anything like that, I'd probably look away for the next couple of seconds so you can kind of see why I wasn't able to wear a climbing shoe or go climbing. But basically what had happened was um, I'm not very good at surfing is what it comes down to. But I was paddling out for a wave um, the nose of the board went underwater, so the board lifted, I didn't catch the wave, and the board started to come out from underneath me, this board actually, but there was a little kid paddling in to the ocean, pretty close to me, and my board looked like it was basically gonna smack him, so as I was falling I had to use my foot to tow hook onto the fins and keep the board with me while the wave kind of pushed me down. But uh, since I grabbed the board with my toes, it basically just took off skin from my foot. It almost looks like if I took a potato peeler to my foot. So that's what had happened. And so I wasn't able to wear a climbing shoe and even just having a regular shoe on uh, wasn't that great. But today when we were setting routes at Hangar, I was able to put my climbing shoe on and forerun with both shoes. Whereas last week on Thursday, I was forerunning with one climbing shoe on my left foot and a regular shoe on my right foot because even having my regular shoe on was not the best feeling. But uh, that being said, my foot's doing better so I should be able to go out and climb a lot more and it's just in time because the weather's starting to cool down and uh, I'm looking to get outside a lot more. There's a few places for sure that I think I want to go to this summer, or this summer, this season, and that's going to be... Red Rocks and Bishop. Red Rocks, honestly, I think is my favorite place to climb. It's got great bouldering, great sport climbing, and the rock quality itself basically doesn't chew up your fingers. So by the time you're done climbing, it's more like you're done because you're fatigued and not because your skin can't hold on to anything anymore because it's so raw. Whereas Bishop, it's super fun also but the rock there is just a little bit more sharp and more textured in a way that it just takes the skin right off. So sometimes even after the first day, your tips are gone and you just kind of have to climb with what you've got left. I don't think I have any projects right now in Red Rocks, but I'm sure they won't be hard to find. And then in Bishop, I'd like to go back and try Seven Spanish Angels for sure and then get back on the Fang, which I tried earlier this year too. Um, the Fang shut me down pretty hard. Seven Spanish Angels is a problem that I was able to get decently far on, but the last few moves were pretty reachy, and it's pretty high, so I'll need a lot of pads, so hopefully I can get some friends to go out there with me uh, sometime this season. But yeah, I'm really looking forward to climbing. And like I said in the last video, I am gonna start training. I really haven't done anything since then though. Training will start and I'll kind of start doing videos with that too so you can kind of see where I'm going with everything and hopefully my performance will will show but yeah so that's why there wasn't a video last week and that's why I'm still not climbing this week the climbing season for me this year is going to be starting off out in Holcomb Valley it's going to be my buddy Matt's birthday he's actually the guy that first took me climbing with my friend Jackie I'm going to meet him and our friend Jake out there and then that's going to be the last weekend of September. And then October, I'm going to do my best to try to get out every weekend, with the exception of the weekend of the 13th, because me and Brianna are actually going to head up to Sacramento to see System of a Down, Incubus, and a few other bands um, at a concert up there. So that'll be cool. That's probably going to be the only weekend in October that I'm not climbing. Uh, fingers crossed, at least. If you have any suggestions or any projects that you guys are working on or that you think I should try, Make sure to let me know in the comments. I'm always looking for something cool to try. I'm super excited for this climbing season. I've already done a lot better this year so far in total than I have in the past by getting uh, multiple V6s, getting my first V5. And yeah, so hopefully I'll be able to continue that trend of getting those higher rated boulder problems 
and hopefully I will be able to avoid injuries. But I'm excited. It's going to be a fun season. I haven't camped since we went out to Red Rocks because it's been so hot. And so I'm looking forward to some more camping weekends, some nice crisp air, and waking up to some boulders. But that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you again for liking, commenting, and subscribing, and I'll see you next week.